Now I'm not gonna claim this was an easy project. SwiftUI really makes us think in a very different way from what UIKit would have done. Not only do you have the declarative, reactive approach to programming, but you also have uh, lots of powerful Swift features like uh, state and the property wrappers and uh, two-way bindings and environment objects and much, much more. It's a combination of lots of powerful Swift features backed up by a wholly new UI framework. Now, in this project, I've tried to expose you to a wide variety of Swift UI features all at the same time. We've seen lists and stacks and forms and alerts and images and pickers and much more. But it's only the beginning of Swift UI. There's so much more it can do. And of course, every WWDC that happens, Apple are adding more and more to this as they go. Now, if you enjoy this brief exposure, I recommend you follow up with my 100 days of Swift UI course on my site at the URL you can see on the screen right now. This is completely free on my site. It walks you through building 100 days of Swift UI, starting with a 12 day Swift primer, and then building real projects with milestones, with challenges, with regular tests to make sure you learned everything you thought you were learning along the way to really help you learn as much about SwiftUI as you can in only 100 days. It's all free, all on my site, stacks of videos, articles, tests, and more. Go and check it out. And if you uh, want to read my completed version of this project, you can do. It's on GitHub. Again, the URL's on the screen right now. Go and check that out.